he will throughout the rest of the night probably be a lot more jokes about George W. Bush. I'm hoping you're okay with that. Uh, again, he's talking about Iran at the moment. And you know what? I think if you're the leader of the United States of America, you should be able to pronounce the word nuclear correctly. <laughs> it's just me. Every time he speaks, they're, they're, Iran may have a nuclear weapon. <laughs> may have a what? <laughs> they may have a nuclear weapon. Wow, should we take them all to the hospital? <laughs> <laughs> I've got an ambulance waiting outside. <laughs> Even in the days following September 11, terrorism suddenly became a three-syllable word. We have seen terrorism, and we must fight terrorism wherever we see terrorism. That's right, it's a three-syllable word now, it's terrorism. <laughs> we must fight this terrorism wherever we see terrorism, and stamp out terrorism wherever there's terrorism. I'm not, being, not making this up. Two weeks after he said that, an Israeli minister was assassinated. The Minister for Tourism. <laughs> Because the problem with making jokes about George W. Bush is if you do, there might be an American in the room who would have every right to stand up and just go, hey buddy, you know, your leader took your nation to war without public approval as well. And we'd have to go, yeah, all right. <laughs> we're even. And if they're smart, they go, no, we're not. You voted for your guy. <laughs> I have spent some time overseas. It's, I don't want to diss our leader, but watching him on television when it's a world issue doesn't seem right. At one point he actually threatened Kofi Annan. The head of the United Nations said Kofi Annan should listen to the rest of the world's leaders. I was just watching, imagining Kofi Annan watching television going, oh shit, I think I've just upset Gollum. <laughs> Seriously, his next address to the nation will go, the people of Australia should know that nobody likes us. Costello is my precious. It's probably the last joke I'll tell this year, ladies and gentlemen, so thank you very much. I'll be back on a little bit later in the show. Now, ladies and gentlemen.